What is up heroes and welcome to this brand new let's play of Luigi's Mansion from the Nintendo GameCube. Something I recently noticed is this game is 14 years old and it's crazy because it feels like kind of recently that I just got my GameCube, got this game with it and started playing through it so many times and then I realised it was 14 years ago which is absolutely crazy. And this LP shouldn't really take too long because this game is actually pretty short. So uh, let's hop straight into it. So we're inside the spooky mansion. Uh, the control is inverted for the flashlight, which is very good. Hold A and we can call Mario. And he is not here, unfortunately. I don't know why, but this game really reminds me of the very first Resident Evil game. With the mansion and the doors, just because when you go and open a door, look what happens. Oh, it's locked though. Just the kind of close-up. Really reminds me of Resident Evil. I don't know if this game was maybe like part of it was inspired by it, because it seems like it could have been. Oh, we got a floating key! If that was me, I would be like, nope, I'm leaving, I'm leaving, let me out. Oh, that little sound you get for getting a key just sounds so bad. Let's go follow the ghost and open the door. You can see the fear in Luigi's arms. There we get introduced to Professor Egad, probably one of my favourite um, Mario characters just because he's so crazy. And all these inventions he makes are just so awesome. You won this mansion in a contest you didn't even enter? Uh, yeah. Sounds pretty fishy to me. So, you believe the mansion actually exists? Then. Strange. I've been living here since I was a lad of 20 or so. And I'll tell you, that mansion appeared just a few days ago. The spirits have fooled you, fooled you. Don't know if it's a dream, an illusion, or what all, but I surely wouldn't be too happy when in a haunted house. Nor would I. That thing would definitely go on the market as soon as I get it. I am not going to be living in no mansion or haunted mansion. 
What? My guy was your brother? Oh no, that's horrible! So, Mario is trapped in the mansion somewhere and we're gonna have to go ahead and rescue him. To deal with Goose, so you can rescue your brother Luigi! Yeah, let's do this! So here are the controls. Here, you move the headphones so I can actually see the TV better. Okay, suck things up the vacuum is R. Z is check inventory. Y map. X. Check the Game Boy horror. <laughs> oh, I forgot it was a Game Boy. Oh, that is so awesome. Uh, turn the flashlight is B and examine door A. Okay, we should easily be able to do this. Little training course right here. <laughs> the Game Boy horror looks so cool. Just because you don't know, that is practically the very old model of a uh, DS. <laughs> Pretty much. I miss the uh, the Game Boy name. I wish the DS was called like a Game Boy DS. That would have been so cool. Alright, let me use the Hoover. Start the training, let's go! I know how to play the game. Yeah, I know. I'm trying, he just disappeared. It's hard to get the timing right. There you go. And I got you. I'm trying to remember what it was on a uh, on the Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon on the 3DS. I'm pretty sure he had a um, DS as his. Uh, Got ya. There's a little communication device which is pretty cool, like the first DS. I think at the time this um, this game came out it was still... Oh god. So many! It was either a Game Boy Advance or it was still a Game Boy Color. I think, I believe it was a Game Boy Color actually, still because of uh, Pokemon Gold and Silver. Now do, well how many did you get? Five ghosts, sir. You're getting the hang of it, Luigi. Yay! Uh, let's uh, in the gallery. I'm quite proud of it, you know. Uh, let's go to the gallery. Ooh, this place looks pretty cool. We. Nope. Welcome to the gallery. I've had 21 paintings in my famous ghost collection, but. No, there are any frames? What a crying shame. Unfortunately, there are only statues here now, but feel free to look around anyway. Okay. Ooh. So I remember we can have to use this Game Boy Horror on a mirror at some point. And that teleports us or something like that. If you guys actually want to play Luigi's Mansion, I highly recommend the uh, the 3DS version, Dark Moon, because that game was uh, a lot longer than this and a lot better. But this game's still good, don't get me wrong. I remember at the time of uh, this game came out, I was so scared to play it. The ghost scared me. Alright, so let's go back to the lab. And we'll go back to the mansion and start this game off properly. To the mansion! And we have Toad! Hello Toad! Where did you go, Mario? Wow! Luigi? Wow, it's Luigi! You finally made it! Oh, joy! Thank goodness! Me? Well, Princess Peach asked me to come here to look for Mario. He left when he heard that you won a mansion. And he never returned. But then, when I arrived here, the mansion was full of ghosts. I didn't see Mario anywhere. I kind of freaked out a little. I didn't even know what to do. It's been awful! Please, please, please! You have to help me find Mario! If he doesn't get back, you have no idea how upset the princess will be. She flip! Leave it to me. Yeah. And the lights turn on. That's a little bit spooky. And we're gonna save it quickly. Surprised I still have a uh, saved data spare on uh, this memory card. 
Let's quickly suck that up. And I think if I do this. Yeah, that happens. I think that teleports me here. Yeah, that's a teleporter. Alright, let's uh, start taking a few things out. Turn the candles up. I think if we suck this, we actually get lots of money. Yeah, money! Let's quickly grab these before they disappear. Uh oh. Ah! So it's a pretty good idea to pretty much search everything on a Luigi's Mansion game, just blow the candles out and search all the drawers. Because this is pretty much a puzzle game, if you think about it. Well, I guess it kind of is. It's the best way to describe it, in my opinion. Okay, let's go in. I think I remember the first boss as well. We're going to see who it is in a second. Not gonna face him just yet though. We got a lot more exploring to do. Okay, blow out the candles, I think we'll find out. There we go. Who put out my candles? You, Mr. Lime Green. Well, dark rooms are dangerous around here, yes. They love the dark and now they will get you. Blah. Now you're in for it, blaga. Just little red cap before you. May you wander lost in the darkness forever. Are you afraid of the dark, little man? Are you? Here they are now. Uh oh. We've woken the hive. Uh, come on. There we go, that's one. Can I pull the. Oh god, quick! You're mine! I think that's the boss there, we can fight that dude. There's some different ghosts, like 100 HP, we've got to fight. <laughs> we need the Legend of Zelda music for this chest. Instead of that horrible... Okay, so we've got this key, which... Uh, is used for that door right there. We can skip this pretty much because it's just opening the door. It just takes a very long time. Oh, hello. Ah, oh, missed you. Ah! Got you. You're mine. Ah! This one's got 20 HP. It's a strong one. Need to drop some health as well, but we don't need it. Oh god! Oh, the controls are actually a bit dodgy. I mean, they're a lot better uh, find on uh, on the reason mentioned Dark Moon, but on the GameCube version, it's not that great. There's still one more somewhere around here. Ah, there you are. I'll quickly check this. Quick for my coins! Ah. So if they scare you, they kind of stop you for, for a second, which is kind of bad. Kind of stun you. Ah, there we go, got you. Where is he? And the door is open. So this is a mirror we can actually kind of zoom in, but I'm pretty sure I'll teleport us back to the start, which we don't want just yet. Ah! Blue ghost! The banana peel there. And a big green one. Oh god. This one's 40 HP. Oh, 
and he throws bananas, so you got to be really careful. I did not know that, or remember that even. I see. I set the bananas up so I don't trip on them. Looking back, I don't see how I was scared of this game when I was a kid. Oh, don't go into the banana peels! Aha! It's good to get the ghosts as well. Get that. And it's Toad! Another one. Mario, where are you? Luigi! Yes, Luigi, how lucky that you found me. I feel so much better now. Please, please, please save Mario. I looked everywhere. I can't find him. Where is he? It's not the same one, is it? <laughs> it looks like Luigi's doing bad things to that plant. Luigi, stop! Stop, Luigi! What are you doing? Alright, let's go back through. I'm gonna search on the mirror. Oh, wait, there's a key up there. Almost missed that. And that opens the door at the start of the game, so it's good to teleport now. So we wanna go up this one. Sec Luigi, it's me, Professor Egad. I detect spirits stronger than we've yet seen lurking ahead. I think it must be some of those escaped gallery ghosts. You should know that they're really different from the other ghosts you've seen so far. They don't show their hearts very easily. Nope, not at all. When you find one, you should first use the X button to search his heart for clues. Sometimes you can learn the best way to surprise him. Well, Luigi, I'll keep my fingers crossed for you. Alright. And there's probably... Oh god! Before we go in there, I'm gonna quickly go in this one first. It's moving by itself! Ouch! I think as well... Oh. Let's quickly search the place. Bunnies! If I remember correctly, if I can get a first person mode, I can't remember how though. Nope, no fire there. Can I set the bottle? It's moving. Got ya! When he was... Oh god! That was a complete accident as well. When he was yawning, I thought that was a good chance to get him. Oh, 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 oh! There we go! I'm pretty sure if I remember correctly. Oh god, let's get that. Alright, if I use the Game Boy Horror. Jeez, there you go, and search it. There should be a gold little uh, ghost rat. Why is that not working? Pretty sure that's what you did. Ah. <laughs> Doesn't look right when Luigi grabs things, it looks so wrong. I don't know what I have to do with that then. Unless maybe I search it and then I... Nope. I don't remember. Maybe because it's light now. Maybe I had to do it when it was dark. That's probably what I had to do. Door is locked. Oh, Jesus! It's a fake door! <laughs> On the ceiling up there. Let's grab you quick. There was another fake door. 
too many fake doors. Another locked door. Don't be a fake. Thank God it's not a fake door. I to search the last one, didn't I? <laughs> Isn't my hair just gorgeous? Of course, I do spend a lot of time on it. So bored, cooped up in the painting. I spend all my time in front of the mirror. Seems to scare people though, so everything is coming up roses. I can blow the curtains open. Oh, there's Toad out there. Oh, got it. Gonna make a draft. You're mine. Come on. Always there. It's not the best method, it's just to sit in the corner and just keep pulling. And we got another chest. Let's grab these pearls or whatever they are. Ah, go the hard pieces, run away from me. Nothing on the bed. Dude, what are you doing out there, buddy? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Luigi, stop oh, doing yeah. things with the chest. It doesn't look right. <laughs> okay, so what door does this unlock? Probably one of the ones to the opposite of where we are. Yep. I won't really check if there's anything down there. So that's going to be the boss. The boss is a baby. Hello, baby. Horsey, Rocky Horsey. So I'm going to rock the horse. There you go. Hey, wanna play with me? Not really, oh god. Ah. Quick, eat the stupid bears. I forgot what I have to do with you, to be honest. So I got the ball. Oh god. Oh wait, I fired at you. I remember. Then I can grab you. No? Ow, you gave me an owie. Just wanted to play with you. I hate grown-ups. Why do you have to be a bigger meanie than me? Oh, bigger than me. Had enough. Small. Now grow smaller. Small, it's a teeny little wee ga ga goo goo ga. Well, this isn't good. This is the first boss. That's actually kind of scary, not gonna lie. Hello, Mr. Big Baby Ghost. Oh. There you go, avoid the horses. Can I take the balls? I think I'm just avoiding all this at the moment. Unless I can pick this one up now. Yep, yeah, there you go, and then eat a ball. You're mine! Come on. Okay, it's nearly halfway down. That's so demonic and weird. I love Luigi's run as well. Run! No, 
my god, more horses. So done. Oh, 13. 13 HP left. <laughs> Just sit here, he probably won't even go after me. Boss is kind of really, really easy, you know, gotta lie. Just gotta kind of stand in one space. And move to the left a little bit. Do the same thing again. Go from the spawn a few balls and then shoot them at him. Which is the real ball? Which is the real ball? Probably this one. So hit me. There we go. Ah! Uh. buddy got this big chest right here and we're gonna get a big pink key I love heart key it looks like this is Luigi Luigi can you hear me oh thank goodness you're okay I lost contact with you all of a sudden I was a tad worried hmm you seem to be a bit uh, tuckered out after that long battle don't you why don't you come on back to the lab when you vacuum the boss goes, your Polygus uh, 3000 gets pretty much full to bursting. But ho oh, ho, I guess you showed that boss goes. Who's boss? I'm the boss. Yeah. Good job, Luigi. You made it back. Take a gander at this. This fine piece of work took nearly 20 years to develop. I call it the Ghost Portificationizer. This machine lets, the, uh, lets us turn the ghost you, you catch into paintings. Not only that, it works to reverse too. Hmm, how do you, we use it? You ask. Well, it's simple. Just plug that Porter Gus 3000 into the slot and enjoy the ride, my boy. are invisible so we need to press them into visible forms and then voila they are paintings oh god that baby looks weird and who's that that is the dad and that's probably the mum hmm well we managed to turn those ghosts back into paintings thanks for your help Luigi and that is the first level completed Neville, Lydia, and John C. Yay! Three million. No, sorry, three thousand hundred seventy-five gold. Plus three million for a second. Let's save the game. Up to area two. Where will you go, Luigi? And we are going to go back to the mansion after this oh, next episode. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next time where we'll do Area 2. Peace.